இப்பொழுது இதைத் தொடர்ந்து ஆங்கிலத்தில் சொல்கிறேன் தெர் இஸ் அர்சன் பை நேம் தஸ் லேடி எ வெரி டிவோட்டட் லேடி பை நேம் புஷ்பா ஹர் ஹஸ்பண்ட்ஸ் நேம் இஸ் முருகேசன் தே ஹவ் பீன் ரன்னிங் இஸ் அப்சன் வித் many many people in the neighborhood they had not seen bhagwan they had picked up bhagwan's name from professor karunakaran who who is conducting regular satsangs in salem many many people have been influenced by him by his satsang and pushpa is one of them for nearly four or five generations Pushpa Murugesan's family had not known the name of their family deity because of which there must have been problems in the family generally what they say is if you do not worship your family deity the way you are expected to by the lineage there might be trouble in the family especially the children and others would fall sick or there may be some defect but uh, we have no idea what they went through but uh, shivurisan ji started to pray to bhagwan chanting his name yogi ram sir kumar all the time to reveal their family deity and where they could find the deity So he was chanting, 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 days passed and one day in his dream the family deity appeared and revealed all the details with such precision that he became so happy and after that they went to the same spot and they found all those details true and so now they have started worshipping the family deity the traditional way there is another incident which shows how much importance bhagwan himself gave to the worship of the family deity a family had come here to the ashram a few years back to do pada puja and the details that they revealed were very surprising they said in their family there was a tradition to name the eldest child to every couple after the family deity at least part of the name aragu must be combined it could be combined with another name but it should be there such was the family tradition but at one point being influenced by a fancy name they had named the eldest child of their descendants some some other name with the result the child began to fall sick often and what was more it was not able to speak they were shocked they didn't know what happened and then finally they came to know about yogi ram sarit kumar bhagwan of tiruvannamalai they had rushed to sanadhi street and they showed the child and they were also complaining about other difficulties in the family one after the other something or the other happening and then bhagwan just looked at them and asked if there was any family tradition regarding their family deity and suddenly they remembered yes yes every eldest child of the family the lineage must be named after the family deity and then bhagwan asked for the name of the child which was falling sick so often which was not able to speak either then they said no no this child we thought we would call by some other name we have not named her after the family deity then bhagwan said see that is the point 
immediately begin to call her in the name of your fame family deed everything would work out well so they understood and then they gave the name aragammai to the child and soon after the child became healthy and what was more she began to talk to the worship of the family deity murugesan family did not know for four generations the family deity and the details he was only chanting bhagwan's nama yogi ram surat kumar all the time and praying to bhagwan to reveal the details of their family deity he promptly the kul devta the family deity promptly appeared in the dream and revealed all the details so you see when you chant the name of the guru who is none other than god then everything that needed to be known would get revealed by itself so now this bhagwan who was not told any of those details by the both the families he found it himself just by looking at the child he knew what the defect was with the family that had visited him and clearly pointed out he is here right in front of us again with a gesture of blessing we do not know what has caused the present situation the pandemic but if we keep chanting the name just like these families did bhagwan may not reveal the cause behind this the subtle cause behind today's situation but he would definitely bring the whole situation under control bhagwan we beg you to free the entire humanity from the clutches of this rakshasa virus and its family and bring back normalcy in every aspect of life everywhere in the world and bhagwan kindly remove the panic and all the the panic the despair and that those negative feelings that follow it and arrest the spread of the disease enter the appropriate medicine so that it would work it would do the killing of this virus and its variants we also pray to you that this medicine should reach all these people who need it badly and bhagwan those great soldiers the tapaswins who are in the field fighting the disease at the very risk of their life please give them protection and all round wellness and the economy very badly needs a boost we pray to you for a lift the and above all we seek your blessings again and again for constant remembrance of your name and to go about our daily life with the attitude of being 
a good instrument in your hands and that with deep gratitude. Jai Yogi Ram Sukhma.